Pauly, and I am the president of MagnaWave PEMF. So PEMF is pulsed electromagnetic frequency. And what that means is that a pulse of an electromagnetic field is actually coming out of the circle. So it goes into the body and stimulates cellular health. So I like to think of it as like cellular exercise. I think that's the best way to explain it. Instead of just electrical pulses, which is like microcirculation that most of the time you would associate with the uh, e-stim or something like that, pulsed electromagnetic field actually puts that magnetic, pulses that magnetic field out very quickly. It penetrates into the body, all the way into the bone area, oxygenates the blood, allows blood to flow more freely, and pulls out inflammation. It should be comfortable, and you should feel it. Most high-power PMF, you can feel. Now, sometimes with, uh, like, larger attachments at lower settings. You may not feel it as much, but basically it should be just a comfortable experience and feel like something you've never really felt before. Okay, so the benefits of PMF last depending on what you're working on. So let's say that you have an animal that's injured and they just hurt themselves. Uh, usually the sooner you get to an injury, uh, the faster it'll be gone and the longer it will last. So we've seen things where an animal may have done a sprain or a tendon and we were able to do a few sessions, maybe one or two in a week, and that problem went away and never came back. Now, if you have a chronic issue uh, that's built up over years and years and years of, let's say, um, back pain, for example, on a dog or a limping, something like that, you're going to need to do several treatments and what happens is it builds on itself. So if you start doing, let's say, two to three treatments a week, um, let's say you do that for a month, at the end of the month, you'll probably be able to go down to one treatment a week, and then eventually to maybe one or two treatments a week, and the benefits will last longer and longer and longer. The more you use it in the beginning and you get your body into that sound state, the longer the treatments will last. So a PMF session can vary depending on what you're treating. So if you are treating a dog, uh, let's say 30, 45 minutes tops. Uh, horses can go anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour, depending on, you know, the animal. That's how large animals are, uh, depending on what's going on. We train our practitioners um, in our MagnaWave Academy to look at the animal and use the machine the best for that animal. So sometimes your animal may only need 15 minutes because otherwise the animal's sound and there's no reason to do any more than that. Uh, sometimes they will, may need an hour because maybe after a big performance or a serious injury. So really, we recommend five to 10 minutes in area, and an area can be this big, or it could be much larger with some of our larger circular attachments. You could, may have, we have double this size loops. So those lay across the back of an animal and that 10 minutes may treat the whole back. So it really depends on the practitioner. And education, education, education. Just like anybody else, if you're purchasing a very expensive piece of equipment, like you're an x-ray tech or ultrasound, you want someone who knows how to use that equipment, read that equipment, and use it to the best of their ability. So, it could be five minutes, it could be an hour. You want to make sure that you have a practitioner who knows what they're talking about, is educated, and can explain what's going to work best for you and your animal. We actually don't set pricing for our practitioners. We allow them to set their own pricing. But we recommend uh, about a dollar to two dollars a minute. So it could be anywhere from, depending if you're treating a cat, it may be 20 bucks. If you're treating a um, horse, it may be 120 bucks. So it really depends on the time, the injury, if they have to travel to you. Um, I would just recommend reaching out to the practitioner in your area. We do have a map on our website that will match you to a practitioner that's close to you. And you can contact them directly and they can go through their pricing. A lot of times they will do specials if you buy multiple um, sessions, which I highly recommend. You don't ever want one session. You're not going to see the power of Magnum if you don't take one one aspirin and never have a headache again. If you have an issue, commit to it, try this, it works. So, MagnaWave will penetrate up to 40 inches. So almost all the way through, well actually all the way through from side to side of a horse or a large animal. Now, when we do a uh, reading of the Gauss levels, we, we pick up that Gauss about 16 inches in is where you really stop feeling it after 16 inches. So it's still penetrating all the way through because we can put a Gaussometer on the other side and read that Gauss, but the actual feeling is about 16 inches. A lot of people think that this is crazy and they're gonna hurt themselves and they get really worried and kind of scared before they try it on, on an animal. Uh, but 
No, you can't overdo it. The most that you can do is called what's called a Hertzheimer reaction. And you can actually have this after a deep tissue massage. And it's where if you have built up years and years and years worth of toxins, um, where when we start releasing those and detoxing you with PMF, that actually causes the body to expel those toxins, which can be a little bit uncomfortable. Sometimes after a deep tissue massage, you may feel like that, ooh, and then that ah feeling where it releases, and that's what can happen. But if you ever have a Hertzheimer reaction, it's important. Drink lots of fluids, get some Gatorade, um, make sure you're eating healthy foods to replace so that the uptake that your cells are doing are actually taking in wellness, uh, are taking in good things, not McDonald's and Dr. Pepper. But I would say um, you're not going to overdo it in a way that it's going to be a problem for you. It's like working out. You could go work out for four hours. It's a great example. And, but the first two hours is where you got the best, you got the best results. Anything after that, you're just not getting, there's no, only so much that your body can take in and do in one day. So when you're putting energy in, you want to make sure that uh, you're doing it correctly. So 30, 45 minutes in the morning, 30, 45 minutes in the afternoon, or maybe an hour a day for a horse, that's about it. But you're not going to hurt yourself or an animal doing more. You're just not going to get any more results. So we have what's called try before you buy. So you can actually rent um, any of our machines for one month or three months. At the end of that, that period, let's say you decide you don't want to buy the machine, we're going to give you half of that rental money back to you. So we will only keep half of it. Now let's say you do want to buy it, which is about 95% of the people do purchase from us. 100% um, of your rental goes towards the purchase of the machine. We also have a 60 day money back guarantee. So we will, uh, if you buy the machine and you have, you will have 60 days, let's say you purchase it outright uh, and you decide, okay, for whatever reason you want to send it back, there's a restocking fee and that's it. So yeah, there's definitely a trial period whether you want to use that 60 day or actually do a one month or three month rental. Absolutely, you can use PMF on humans. PMF is FDA cleared um, in lower power machines to be used on humans. MagnaWave's lines of machines are directly designed for animals. So these machines is what we market to animals, uh, but it's not dangerous to use them on humans. We just recommend that you purchase from another one of our other lines, which is called AuraWell, uh, that has human devices. If you are looking to start a business and work as a medical professional, you need to get a medical professional machine. Now they're made in the same facility. They do have a lot of the same um, good manufacturing practices, but in terms of the abilities and the FDA clearance and what the machines are registered for are different. So depending on what you're looking to do, you can use PMF on humans. But if you're marketing a business, you need to choose the right machine that has the correct clearance and classification for that business. I get the question a lot, like, if you're using MagnaWave, do you have to see movement? Like, does there have to actually be muscle stimulation to get results? And the answer is absolutely not. You do not, if you are turning this machine up on an animal to get pulsing, then you're doing it wrong. I mean, and I hate to say it that way, but go back through the MagnaWave Academy. The idea is to be on a low setting when you start a treatment and to go over the animal's body. Um, and then on that low setting, if you start seeing movement, that's where you know. So I'm saying anywhere between two and four. If you're seeing movement on a two or a four in different areas, that's an area of sensitivity. Then you can turn it up and get some release but you don't need to make the body move to get results. If an animal is not comfortable with that, don't do it. The, the PMF is working. It penetrates all the way down. You definitely don't need to have the movement. If the movement feels good, that's great, but it doesn't have to be there. What I always recommend, don't do a, a session right before, the first session you do on your animal, don't have it be before a big performance or right you want to see how they're going to respond just like a massage for a human some people get out of a massage and they're like "Woo, I feel great some people step out and they're like I want to go take a nap now I'm exhausted and that's animals are the same way so you want to make sure that you do a session and see how your animal responds um, if they respond with energy and there are I would say about 50% of the animals do where they actually perform better and then you want to do it before the, set, the, the, the event. If they aren't responding better and they really do get a little lackadaisical and they want to relax, that's just their natural body responding to the session and using the energy that you just put into the body correctly. So then you may want to wait 48, 24 to 48 hours before performing. But in terms of just working them, there really isn't anything. You can put them out, you can walk them, you can do anything 
right after a session. So before or after a MagnaWave session, we recommend that you make sure water is available to your animal. Uh, you in, in with people, you want to make sure they're drinking water. Um, and you want to make sure that they, you are looking at them and seeing if they're comfortable. Maybe they do want to go out and be in the paddock. Maybe they do want to sleep. Just kind of learn to read your animal. And if you have a really, really good practitioner, which are I would like to think that all of the MagnaWave Academy graduates are, they're going to be able to read your animal and tell you, hey, I think it might be good to put them out. I think it might be good to keep them in. So there really isn't any um, thing to make sure except that they have water. And the reason for that is because you are detoxing and water is what we need to survive. So it's really great to just let them stay, you want them to stay hydrated.